From Castle Rexworth and the Rexworth Estates, I bid you good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever you are and whenever you are. My name is Rexworth, Lord Rexworth, and I welcome you to Monday night. We're going to be playing Gravity Circuit for a bit, and um, if I feel like going on a bit longer, I might also pick up Black Mesa, so we'll, um, we'll see how we do uh, with each one of these. But uh, thank you all so much for joining me. Thank you all for the uh, for all the liveliness and the silliness and just being dear, lovely, beautiful people uh, while you wait for me to uh, to make my entrance. Uh, Noah, welcome. Verena, welcome. Bun, welcome in. I uh, consider myself blessed to be surrounded by dear, lovely, beautiful people and kind souls, all of you. And um, just thank you for being you. Thank you for uh, thank you for being here. Just thank you in general. Thank you all. Um, and your support means means everything to me. So thank you. Um, those of you who are new here, uh, my name is Lord Rexworth. I'm an English nobleman VTuber. I stream a variety of content. From video games to ASMR to uh, Zatsudan and just chatting streams. And um, I invite all of you, if you haven't already, to uh, do give me a follow uh, on Twitter. Twitter.com forward slash Lord Rexworth. Uh, of course, keep in touch with me via the Discord. Um, yes, and also a podcast in now too. Yes, we got the Lord Rexworth podcast. I do need to update the website to... Um, have the uh, embedded ACOS player um, so that uh, you can access it directly from the from the website. But uh, I will put up a link there. Um, but uh, in the meantime, you can also uh, find my find the link on my Twitter page, or you can join the Castle Rexworth Discord if you're uh, age eighteen or over. And then, of course, uh, there is my uh, website, LordRexworth.com. That's LordRexworth.com. Uh, um, the usual things, uh, to, uh, go ahead and plug while we're at it. Um, I got a throne page. Gifts always preceded, never required, of course. Uh, you can go to throne.com forward slash, uh, Lord Rexworth. I've also got a throne powered shop with a few items I've specially curated. Um, you know, if you're, uh, looking for some lifestyle products, maybe a new computer, uh, or perhaps, uh, you're wanting to get into VTubing or streaming or some type of content creation, I've hand selected a few items that I think will be uh, that are quality goods that I think will be uh, that will be of help to you. So LordRexworth.store is the uh, is the website. Uh, my comms are open as well, and you'll see the links throughout uh, throughout the stream. Um, voice packs are available uh, by buying me uh, a coffee, or you can uh, have a uh, have a special custom audio message uh, by your favorite sexy anime British husbando and noble Rizzler. Um, all the information is available on the uh, on the coffee page there. You can just click that link there and chat. A uh, quick read of our sponsors here. Uh, Dubby is uh, what powers his lordship, though I haven't had some Dubby in a while and I am starting to feel it. But anyways, you can stay um, you can stay hydrated and energized with Dubby by using the code Lord Rexworth at checkout for ten percent off your order when you go to Dubby.gg. Just click that link there in the chat. Dubby.gg code Lord Rexworth, all one word at checkout, ten percent off your order. Dubby, be better. Also brought to you by the Cash App. Try the Cash App using my code. We'll both get five dollars when you link a new bank account and send five dollars. Just click that link there in the chat. Download the Cash App today. We also brought to you by NordVPN. Be safe when you're online. Enjoy greater privacy as well. Try NordVPN risk-free for 30 days. They've still got their Christmas sale going on. Click the link there in chat. And uh, stay safe online with a little help from NordVPN. Finally, brought to you by Wise. Open your Wise account now. Uh, if you do any sort of international traveling like I do, um, then you... Uh, spend money in multiple currencies. You don't just confine yourselves to uh, US dollars or Canadian dollars or euros or the British pound sterling. And the WISE account helps you to uh, helps you prepare for travel 
by uh, transferring your home currency to another currency, wherever you may be traveling. Uh, best of all, uh, free withdrawals at ATMs up to $250 and no foreign transaction fees. So click that link there in chat, open your WISE account today. And with all of that, let's go ahead and begin Gravity Circuit. <laughs> sound makes it seem like I've turned on a Famicom or... Uh-oh. What did I do? Oh no, I closed it by accident. Let me get this resized for our window here. And we'll also get the uh, classical music turned down here. There we go. Let's see here. And this is the sort of game that calls for the Xbox controller. Sounds a toddy-esque almost. Indeed, indeed. And uh, definitely giving off uh, old Rockman, Mega Man vibes. So, no, I don't want to access the Steam community while playing. Away with these pop-ups, I say. And when we last left off, I think we had arrived at our home base. Oh, look, they use Bitcoin in this game. Lovely. Suga, hello! Good to see you, my friend. Bonjour, monsieur. You play as John Mega Man, indeed. <laughs> I, I am John Mega Man, the best man who ever megaed. <laughs> I'm doing all right, Suga. Uh, let's see. Checking in here with the colonel. The logo on his shoulder makes him. It reminds me of the. Uh, reminds me of the. The symbol in the power coin for the for the Green Ranger from Power from Power Rangers. Um, I wonder if there's if that's supposed to be a nod to that. No way, Colonel. Yeah. Uh, where are my manners? I am Colonel, the commander of the Guardian Corps. Or what's left of it, anyway. I see. But if this is Guardian Core HQ, why was Cable out to get you? Well, I wish I could tell you. After the first conflict with the virus army, we only managed to recover your body. So, we assume the other circuits are gone, well, um, offline. But now, with power circuits showing up at our door like this, it shakes my servos to their core. A virus army. How long has it been? I'm afraid it's been many, many years. Decades since the virus army first appeared by my count. Your memory banks haven't gone cold, have they? Dot, dot, dot. Ah, well, that's, um, unfortunate. I was hoping you could perhaps shed some light on the situation, but I guess we'll have to do some digging ourselves. I'll check in with our operators and see what we can find out. In the meantime, feel free to explore the base. It isn't what it used to be, but I hope you can find some comfort in it. Today, tomorrow, the next day. Welcome in, welcome in. When you're ready, see me in Mission Command upstairs. All right, Dragon Caesar. Fun fact, that's what the Dragon Zord was called in Zuderanger, the original source material for Power Rangers. Let's see, this is Kronos. Oh, it has gotten so awfully quiet in here. The HQ used to be bustling with a lot of activity, but I guess the virus army made everyone take cover and hide. I hope nobody's gotten hurt. 
Ah, yes, our librarian friend. I'm ready to see you, Commander. <laughs> hmm, interesting. So, what makes that mechanism tick is... Oh, beg pardon, didn't notice you coming in. Hold on a moment, though. I don't think I recognize you. Who might you be? My databanks have been a fair bit unordered lately, so give me a moment here. Red and orange chassis, uh, square shoulder pads, gauntlets of bright gems, big pronged emblem, seems to have been kept in pristine condition. Ah, you must be Kai, the gravity circuit. Right, you have done your homework, but what is this place? A research unit? Oh yes, the Guardian Corps Data Archive, in fact. When the virus army attacked years ago, many of our records were destroyed. So, I've been piecing together whatever little still remains. I not see any computers. How are you recording your findings? Oh, well, I'm glad you asked. We are using my latest innovation. Books. Books? Really? Yes, books. They don't require power, they're, and they're just nice to hold. Even if it takes a little moment to find the passages I need from these pages. Small price to pay, achieving, archiving everything is what matters. In fact, if you happen to find any data chips lying around, bring them to me. With a bit of effort, we can analyze their contents and add them to our records. I'll see what I can do. Much appreciated, Gravity Circuit. Shortage. Is our game is our name Gravity Circuit? Um name of the character is Kai, but yeah, I think his like his superhero title is Gravity Circuit. Yeah, I think that's how that works. Hello, nurse. No, literally, it's a nurse. Ah, our honored patient is awake, is he? That's a relief. And just in time, too. Although you didn't need to break our healing chamber to get out of here, I'm sure. Um, and who might you be, Miss... Uh, oh, no need for formalities, silly. I'm just a plain old nurse bot helping here in the med bay. Just wanted to stop you so I could give you this. New chip acquired. Energy absorber. <laughs> Animaniac's joke wins double points for me. Yes, I love that show growing up. Ah, oh, much appreciated, miss. Don't mention it. Should you need more of these, come see us. While repairing bots is our primary duty, we also research various chips. These chips range from passive bonuses to even giving you new abilities. We'd be honored to make more of them for our dear hero, but uh, we would like to ask for your help in turn. All right, what can I do for you? What you heroes do best, of course, rescuing civilians. In all this ensuing chaos, there are many, many civilians in need of help. Just thinking about them getting hurt, it, it angers me so. Should you come across any, please send them over here to the HQ where it's safe. For each heroic rescue, we will give you a rescue token. You can then use these tokens to research new chips. For a small fee, of course. Always a catch, isn't there? Last week I saw Tiny Toons on TV. Apparently they're in college now. What? That means we're really old. Yeah, don't don't remind me, please. <laughs> right, I'll see what I can do. Many thanks, our sneaky little patient. Oh, this must have been where I broke out. It actually wasn't bad, but Babs's voice was horrid. Yeah, um, I... I think the same voice actress who voiced, uh, Babs Bunny is the one who also, uh, voiced, uh, Dot Warner. And um yeah, I can I could have especially tell with the with the Animaniacs revival 
Um, it, yeah, it, her voice is starting to sort of, kind of show its age. I mean, she doesn't sound bad. It just, you know, she just, you can tell they're, they're all, everyone, uh, even, um, gosh, what's his name? Um, gentleman who played the voice of Yakko and uh, Bugs Bunny, and no, not Bugs Bunny, um, Buster Bunny. Um, he's also kind of starting to, his voice is also starting to show its age just a bit. I mean, it's been 30 years. We we can't expect anything otherwise, really, when you think about it. Valid, yeah. Salutations, Gravity Circuit. I hate to be the bitter of bad news, but our radars are picking up virus army activity all around us. Fortunately, the activity around the HQ is low thanks to you, but they are targeting some key areas, crippling our resources. We, or the city for that matter, won't last long if this keeps up. When virus army first appeared, they seemed chaotic and unorganized. How are they so well coordinated this time? Well, the answer should be pretty obvious, don't you think? They're following the commands of those rebelling circuits. No, oh, who are you? Pardon my intrusion. I'm Nega, just a humble traveling bot. Hmm. Very well, but uh, what was that that you said? The virus army is taking orders from the rebel circuits? Indeed. These rebel circuits intend to strong-arm full control over the city. Or destroy it entirely. Whichever happens first. Oh. We are doomed, aren't we? Oh, ye of little faith. You, gravity circuit. What about you? What will you do? I'll go after them. Don't understand why they're doing this, but they must be stopped. Hmm, that's a good answer. However, are you ready to do what it takes? Uh, I don't know, but you've got to give it a shot. Very well. Should you need any help honing your skills, feel free to seek me out. I can teach you an extra trick or two for a price. Now, if you'll excuse me. Oh, thank you for siding with us, Gravity Circuit. You have my eternal gratitude. Just call me Kai. All right, Kai it is. Meanwhile, it seems like our operators have finished their analysis. Multiple circuit signals have been picked up supporting Nega's claim. As much as I hate to say it, the others really have become rebel circuits. Dun, dun, dun. Kai seems like he's just trying to exist and everything's being thrust onto him. Yeah. <sighs> but he possesses great power, Arkai, and to whom much is given, much is required, I suppose. At this point, it's safe to assume they won't cooperate with us. So, unfortunately, you most likely will have to take them out. Yes, I know. I'll do everything I can to protect the city. Thank you, Kai. Here are the mission locations with suspected rebel circuit activity. Oh, this does seem a lot like Mega Man, doesn't it? Let's see. Central Station is complete. We've got the junkyard. The steelworks stop overheating. Let's get it to there. Mountains. Power plant. Recapture the facility. The warehouse area. Stop the hacking. Ore mines. Prevent the collapse. City center. Prevent damage. Highway. Chase hijackers. I'm going to fight Airman. <laughs> hmm. yeah, let's go to the city center. Let's give that one a try. Large speakers have been installed all over the city by the virus army. They're emitting loud, deafening blasts, trapping civilians all over downtown. And if that wasn't enough, a giant billboard depicting Medley has also appeared. 
just as playful as ever, she's clearly toying with us, inviting us over. Normally, we would ignore such distractions, but civilians are at risk. So, go out there and put an end to her little stunt. They're playing break call. Stop them. <laughs> And when you see her, could you get her e-signature for me? I'm a big fan. Do you want to take on this mission? Oh, uh, yes. The plane break core, after all. We have to stop them. Very well. Prepare for transfer. Simple matter of timing on this one, I think. Just right. Okay, now. has been assisted.
time it just right, time it just right. the beginning. Wanted. Oh, come on. Ladies and gentlemen, why I was always more of a Sega boy and preferred Sonic games over anything that Nintendo had to offer. A skill I could make up for in speed. would rather go fast than shoot. I mean, if I can do both, that'd be fantastic, but, you know, you take what you can get. To be fair, I was never good at Mega Man either. There was one particular title that I was quite good at, and that was the Mega Man Legends series. That one I did quite well on, of course, that was on the PlayStation. Does anybody remember Mega Man Legends, I wonder?
I'm normally not one for rage quitting, but I swear to God, this game. Why? Sometimes you're giving the most rage inducing titles. Uh. Uh, <laughs> thank you, Noir. Oh, go to checkpoint. Ah, oh, thank God. Oh, dear. Oh, dearie me. The boxes, they... You touch them and they fall... They got spikes on the top. See, you got this, and I... Uh, no, I don't got this. <laughs> all right, all right. Maybe I've got this, maybe.
Oh, I see a civilian. I really want to go help them, but just no. Great cost to my sanity, probably. <laughs> uh, God. Mm. You stop that. Difficult time climbing walls. This segment's about to make me start climbing the walls. Dashing. Ouch. Jay Drago, welcome in, welcome in, good to see you. You're watching me lose my mind slowly, playing Gravity Circuit. <laughs>
back to where we were before. Hopefully I've got enough charge to make it. No! No! Oh! <laughs> Ten more minutes and we're switching chat. See, have fun. Yeah, this is. <laughs> this is also costing me. Um... Thank you for the hydrate. <laughs> And the stretch. Ah. <sighs> Thank you, Noah. Um, yeah, you know what? Let's let's switch over to a different game. I know I've got um something I know I'll I'll be a lot better at <laughs> because that was just embarrassing. Gracious every time. I think we were in the home stretch on on Black Mesa. So we're gonna switch over to that. I have a meaning to pick it up again for a little while. And so that's what we'll do. get a position just right. There we go. The games are tough. They're meant to be tough, so don't feel bad. Yeah, I suppose you're right. Anyway. Let's see. We. Yeah. 
We were in the Lambda Core. I remember that much. We had actually made it over to... Do you have any idea that we're working on this kind of stuff? Ah, good, we're fully stocked. Both pump stations have been positively overrun. Take these supplies and hurry. Yeah, that makes sense. Lead the way, sir. So we've got to fix the pump stations. System zero one. Sorry, Freeman. Gordon probably hates being the chosen one here. Yeah. <laughs> Don't do anything. Hates being the chosen one, and yet, the chosen one he is. We sort of get thrust into our roles at times, and if not us, who? If not now, when? Black Mace is really cool, but there's something about the original Half Life that makes it charming. I agree. I agree. Oh dear. Black Mesa was definitely, definitely built for people who loved Half-Life 2 and wanted to have more of that with the first game. I remember in the late 90s when... Half-Life first came out and I was actually playing a demo of it in an electronics store I was just god it was so cool 
Nick, thank you so much for the follow. I don't necessarily do uh, follow for follow, but I will check out your content. And um, if I like what I'm seeing, I shall follow back. Hmm. Camera feed unavailable. Please restart system. Effective. I can't even tell what part we're at compared to the original. I know, right? Yeah, the Lambda Complex, this is not the way I remembered it in the first game. This is... this is quite different. I am... I mean, it's cool and all. It is almost... If, I mean, it feels like a brand new game in so many ways. But... Yeah, but also it is a, a bit disorienting, maybe? Artistic liberties. That, that could be... That could very well be. Then again, I, I have to wonder if a lot of this that was seen was what got left on the cutting room floor, so to speak. some challenges early in the early in Black Mesa where you had to like go find go find a wheel a wheel like this one that had just kind of fallen off so it kind of makes me wonder if they had developed a lot of this stuff for the first Half-Life but they just weren't able to implement it for whatever reason It's not letting me turn any of them.
pas. I think there'd be a good enough reason as to why they cut out those specific parts, so it seems tedious to add them back into a remake. And that could be... I don't know. But I also don't make video games. <laughs> I don't know how much I should say, but... I would be remiss as a member of Project Astadia if I did not at least uh, tease my audience a little bit with something that is to come in the future. And that is that um, we are in the planning stages of uh, a little something interactive and electronic as it were. I can't say much more than that, but it's something we're really excited about, and we think it's going to be a lot of fun, and you're all going to enjoy it very much. Lord Rexworth or Tormeg. <laughs> well, I, I don't know about a Tome, but, um... Action bastard. I, um... <laughs> I do hope you'll forgive me. I ended up rage quitting on, um... On Gravity Circuit. So, uh, I decided to switch over to Black Mesa. Of course, I'm thinking I'm going to raid Pink Zombie later on. So, I think that would be appropriate for both of us. Since she's also playing, uh, Black Mesa tonight. Currently playing the role of house husband with the wifey wife, having caught the sickness that I got, and now uh, just now having a moment to spare and check in. Oh dear, I am sorry to hear that action. I do hope you both uh, you both feel better soon. It's awful to be sick around this time of year. No worries, completely understandable given the difficulty of the game. Yeah, Sam, thank you for the lurk. Let's see, did that. Okay. Do a quick save of this. That's a long way down. A long way down. Anything that is... Yeah, we're going to have to go back down. Oi! I 
I've gotten better, about 90% well on my end. Thankfully, I've got plenty of tea and NyQuil for the missus, yes. Tea makes just about everything better, really. And I don't just say that as an Englishman. Glad to hear that you're doing better, though. open. Most uncalled for. You may die for that now. Sounds like something Chris Broad would say to Gron. <laughs> uh, yeah, probably if they were able to do any sort of uh, any sort of multiplayer gaming together. Which I don't know if, if Chris Broad would go for anything like that. I know Connor would be stoked if uh, if they were to do something like that. Ammo on this one. Uh, let's see what next now. What next? What next? Is there anything we can do here? Anything with these witches or anything? No. What's this? Oh! More ammo. Perfect.
do anything with that. Anything with this, perhaps. For quality pest control, you can't go wrong with Black Mesa. <laughs> sending to yeah one of the barnacles one of the barnacles got me could have sworn I saw a lift somewhere did I miss it they pull slow it seems yeah they give you a couple of seconds where you can hear it, and then they start, um... They grab slow, and then they pull up a bit slower. I know the old ones, they used to be a lot faster than this. Thank you for the hydrate. Well, what are you standing around for, man? Okay, let's go. We've got work to do. beast his face off. Let's see if we can start turning on the. Hmm. There you are.
Oh. Health and safety is going to have some words about this. Right, that doesn't blow up, apparently. Activated the manual override for something. Ah, for the doors. Take a bath. It's gonna be lurking time went off for the oven, so we're gonna finish making dinner for everyone in the house. Alright, action. Appreciate you stopping by. Thanks for the lurkies too. Take the lift down if we can. Taking a sweet time. There it is. avoid any one of these beasties popping out of nowhere.
Okay. Both pumps and tanks online. I think. I see how it is, okay. Not at all. Who are you, Kotoka? Let's do this. Oh dear. Oh, they really don't want me to be over here. over the edge. We should probably get our asses in gear, Doc. Yes, I'm well aware. Uh 
Huh. turned on the pumps. Now take the access pipe, flood the core, and get on up to the labs without delay. easier to climb ladders in this game. I remember the old one, you kind of took your life in your hands. I definitely don't remember this from the first game.
definitely not. Goose, hello! It's, um... It's going. I'm having to, uh... Dodge laser traps. Ouch. the Spanish VA for the death noises. No, I don't think I have. Sent it for after stream. All right, we'll take a look. Now, what's this? Sounds like a normal dude. Oh, all right. No nerd voice, huh? Eh? big red button. I want to push it and it doesn't do anything. Ah, there's a portal. What's a class one forklift doing there? I don't know. Pity we can't drive it. fit in the holes. Yeah, I don't know. I... Must have something to do with that over there, behind that door. Gordon, no, you're not forklift certified. <laughs> it is a freaking zoo. Up ahead, Doc. Tread lightly. I was. Just didn't renew it. Still have my OSHA safety certification. Hey, that's a good one. Okay. All right. I'll hold it down over here. Get on your game face, Doc. Forklift, um... Forklift certification, from what I understand, was, uh... Actually, uh, quite a valuable one to have. Driver 
Service permit should require a new test every five years. It is in Canada. Hmm. Well, there you go, chat. If you uh, have yourself a, a forklift license, thinking you're about to say something profound. then um, consider relocating to Canada. Entry-level pay for forklift operator is 30 to 50 per hour. Ooh, nice. You're more like. But I, you, but how? Holy crap! Exactly, Vaughn. Exactly. More at risk of going to jail than the average worker. What, just rough living, or? Lift is 10 metric ton, man and a max around 150 metric tons. Ton brick moving in a snail's pace will still turn a foot or human into paste. There's an image. to bump into a person and not die, but a car going at the same speed will push you. Mm. Was that the G-Man just now? Ball of conservation of momentum. So that's what it's called. G 
G-Man, get him, yeah. into a one pound brick the 10 pound brick will lose 10 percent of its speed that's in zero a zero g no atmosphere environment hmm. just right. There we are. You're the one from the Anomos Materials Labs, aren't you? I recognize you. Shucks. I thought you were the pizza guy. Well, hey, the good news is it took more than half an hour, so your pizza's free. No unloading, sir. Power, 70%. Might not want to stick around too long, Doc. These two guys are on like an old married couple. We are an old married couple. What do you mean, old? Oh, hell. Not again. Oh, it stops you, yeah. Won't be able to progress in the storyline. save here. Why can't games be like Mortal when you can kill every NPC except one and still beat the game? Um... Do... Do a flip... Whoa! No! Did that already and it didn't turn out so well. Yeah, see? Oh. Might be an event. No, it just sort of put me back where I started. Mm. 
What hit you? It was a pipe. The big pipe, and I, I hit it, and it just, yeah, that thing over there. Quick on the timing with this. Was it? Quick save. Oh, come on. I do not want to have to keep coming back to him. Ah. No! If he was an envoy, I don't think he is. Oh. That was the wrong one. No. We do not go through portal number nine. Oh, yeah, this room's fun. Hmm. room just frog yeah i think it I'm, this does seem to have like a very fancy frogger vibe to it Goodness. Pink Zombie, welcome in. Welcome in, Raiders. Hello, hello. Gosh, Pink, I thought I was going to. Um... My name is Bond. James Bond. Yeah, Mesa Monday. They built all this knowing one man would have to save everyone one day. Hello there. Hello there. Hello, Raiders. Pink, how was, uh, how was your gameplay of Black Mesa, by the way? Shout out here to Pink Zombie. It was stressful. Oh, dear. Where's my shout out? May have to do it the old-fashioned way. There we go. A dumb army. <laughs> Think what? Oh, wow, 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 wow. They're having a jolly time playing error at twitch.tv forward slash error. 
I think stream elements is broken. I'm going to dip like a potato chip. All right, Goose. Yeah, be safe. You too. How are you, Rexy? I'm doing all right. Doing all right. This is actually the result of me having a rage quit gravity circuit earlier. But uh, despite the stress, hope you had a good stream. I'm asleep now. All right. Sleep well, Pink. Thank you for the lurkies. Uh, Raiders, if this is your first time here, I'm Lord Rexworth. I'm an English nobleman VTuber. I stream a variety of content, and I also uh, I also have a podcast that I do. So do feel free to uh, grab some hydration, get up and stretch a bit, relax, and good night. Good night, Pink. Good night. Sleep well. Trouble coming down the lift here. No, got lucky. Whoa! No, 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 no. So this is the guy, huh? Thought you'd never make it. Oh, nonsense, Hunter. Nothing stands in the way of our errant knight in shining high impact reactive armor. No. Right then. This way, Dr. Freeman. We've been expecting you. This way, Gordon. What you see before you is the supply depot for our first survey team. Quite a few handsome specimens were collected from the border world and brought back this way. Before the survey members started being collected themselves, that is. These readings have given us reason to suspect that there is an immense portal over there, created and maintained by the intense concentration of a single powerful being. I'm sure that you will know it when you see it. I am loath to say this, Gordon, but you must kill it. Yeah, you better kill it. No ifs, ands, or asses about <clears throat> it. <clears throat> of course, you owe us nothing, Dr. Freeman. But you've come this far. You know as much about these creatures as anyone. Enough to know that if you don't wipe it out, well, let's put it this way. There ain't gonna be much for you to come home to. Yes. So if you're willing, my colleague is waiting for Oh, if they only souls. knew. Dr. Steinman will open the gates for you. All the and foreshadowing. Don't Hunter's brash attitude frighten you. We've all been a wee bit wrangled since the incident. He'll equip you with the proper armaments for the task ahead. Do hurry. Thank God. I thought you were one of them. And the HEV suit.
Dr. Freeman, so glad you made it. I've one final accoutrement for you. This is the long jump module. I created it expressly for navigation in the world beyond. I certainly hope you've received long jump training, because once you're in Zen, you will need it. So, you're actually gonna go through with this, huh? You're brave. That's anyway. the idea. This here is my personal collection. The best military grade hardware this side of the Rio Grande. Have at it. Just promise me you'll put it to good use. Saddle up. That's cool. All right, I can open the portal now. The process is complicated, and once it has begun, I must not be interrupted or I'll have to start all over again. Don't enter the beam until I give the okay. Understood? I will begin.
I wish I could. Wow. You're not it. Wow. Here we are on Zen. Talk about your strange new worlds, your new life and new civilizations.
Sounds like whales. Quite a tractor beam, but um, it'll do. That's interesting. These crystals charge up my HEV suit. Oh, very interesting indeed.
floating around over there. Wipe your feet. Don't wipe the board. Someone's got a sense of humor. HEV suited zombies. Goodness. appear to be a power source. A very interesting power source at that. Hmm.
Okay, that's connected there. Now we just need to get a crystal in there. Ah. Right, this should do the job. Sounds just like me when I die in this game. Explosive. Let's see what we have to do. Okay. There we go. to long jump our way over. Oh, my. 
new surprises await us in this section of Black Mesa. Well, to answer that question, we're actually going to have to pick it up later. Perhaps sometime next week. For now, though, it is getting uh, rather late for me. And um, do need to make sure I go to bed at a decent hour. So, with all of that said, let's go find someone to raid. My first option, a pink zombie. She has already gone off to bed. So, we will instead... Find somebody else. You know who we haven't. Let's see. Let's see what's what are they up to tonight? Yeah, you know what? Let's go uh, do. Let's go watch a chill stream from uh, Bluebee. He's playing PC Building Simulator Two. That sounds like fun. All right. Raid has been created. And let's get that copy pasta pasted in here for everybody. All right. Thank you all so much for joining me. I will see you all tomorrow night for Hitman World of Assassination. I'm Lord Rexworth, wishing you all the best and God bless.